Hey guys, today I wanted to do, highlight a really fun game that I have between myself and Neil's first friends, which he does every Monday. Uh, in it, we are only running Nurse's Calling, which of course is impacted by Plague's power. So uh, we're going to go have a very fun time with this and see what we can do. <laughs> okay, we're going to load in on Father Campbell's Chapel. This is one of my favourite maps. Uh, the RNG is quite dependent. If they have the main window in the main building, then it can be very difficult. And of course, depending on what spawns our shack, uh, it can be quite hard there. Otherwise, all the loops are very manageable. Um, we're going to puke on these few gens. Take that one again, for good measure. Why not? Uh, I totally didn't remember that. Uh, we could visit Boon, not a big deal. Boons aren't a big deal for Plague, but we're just going to go through and infect all the gens and have a little look for where the survivors are. We think we see someone on there. Uh, it's Nina. Hey, Nina. We're going to charge up our here, try and get a, a mouthful on her. So I didn't know it, but she's actually got Dark Fairy on this coaching, so she's 2% faster than she's of course, hmm. we love fake to keep validation, so it doesn't behave with big sticks. Uh, so we're just going to keep going until we get it. Um, have to have to do that. We can get a little shack. Put this corner nice and tight. Again, 2% faster, otherwise that would have hit. Uh, but my time is all a little bit off. But still, we are gaining a bit of distance on her here. She frees the pallet and we get out the window. <laughs> we're gonna go throw up on that hook that we see over there, and then we're gonna go see what other spiders we can find. Give a bit of a few points because we've not managed to get her infected before, and then let's go find someone else to chase. No one on that gen. Uh, we can hear that there's no one on the gen in the middle. But we do see a survival on this gen over here. We can see the sparks if they're working. Take them nice and early in chase. Very good. When you're playing play, it's important to infect the survivor as early as you can. Especially if they haven't used the to play yet. Uh, the difference between infecting someone before and after live, for example, is a very, very big deal. So we're going to fully infect this room gym, go for a nice little mind game, get the provoke, and... Bang. Nice! We're going to lose our first gen, which is a shame, but what can you do? We're not running any regression perks. Uh, so we're going to go and find whoever completed that gen, try and cut them off, because they will be looking to get this unhook, I'm pretty sure. Have a look in all these crevices, see if there's any stealthy survivors. Unfortunately, to get the unhook, probably slip past me somehow. I'm not quite sure how. I'm kind of interested, but uh, not much we can do. But uh, we see the survivor at rescue. We're going to go for them. We don't want to come and call your friends. Uh, in fact, they're nice and quick. They not that hard, but we don't wait long enough. They get a pallet. Leap the man a few times. I should have broken it from the other side and tried to go away from the map. We are on a set of our keyboards. Let's see what we can do. Can we hit them with the exact same mind game as the survivor? Let's give it a go. Yes, we can. No. <laughs> we are going to go hook them on this hook that we saw and then go grab our power. We noticed it was right behind us when we were chasing the survivor to start off with so we're going to go grab that because we are losing gens at an alarmingly fast rate take this up. see if we can do something about this unhook also this tree in the corner save that person very nice so we're going to go for the jeep who's in the building if anyone's not sure what happened here, there is a 3 second period that Plague can't hit anyone with a corrupt puke if they've already been hit with another corrupt puke. So this knee is on the gen here, so we're going to go down here, pick up the jeep. 
We're going to quickly check if basement is behind us in the building, but no, it's in check. Right? So this is what we'll have to do. Hook the gate. And then we're going to go pick up this near. We don't care too much about uh, the one right here. We're only here for a fun time. Hello, Nia. Would you like to have a knee hook through your shoulder, maybe? Uh, they're going to go in the other hook. We could drop here, but again, I'm not that bothered. Plus, we can hear quite a few other people around here. So let's go bother them on this gen. Nina again. Nina. I need to down you quickly. We're going to grab our puke here. We cannot have a long chase here. This is quite a strong set because it is. So we get to down as fast as we can. Fake, fake right. Cut left. And we get it. I'm not going next to this gen. I'm not even going to bother to play surgeon. It's way too early in the game to care about. We need to go and push people with that gen because I'm guessing they'll be working on it. That one's got quite a bit of focus as well. This is not looking good for us. But yeah, there's two people on this gen, you can see. But we have 30 seconds of power left. Let's see what we can do with it. Spot the Jake. Jake, no balls running straight. I was expecting some kind of feedback, but uh, well played. We need out of our power, but this isn't a very safe place. No pallet, one pretty weak window. So we're just gonna fake the vault. Pick him up here. They're probably gonna be on that last gen. Not much we can do about it. They got the rescue on Nina. Yeah. So we're just going to try and go for a few more hooks. We know the knee is going to be a back on this gen. There we are. Oh, it's the young gen. Wait, the power drop. I reacted so late to this. I saw her and my primitive brain went, Ooga Ooga, Survivor must leave. <laughs> uh, but we're not going to cap this out. We're just going to pick them up. And even though we could... Um, go for a bit of snowball here. We're not going to bother. This is pure friends. We want to have fun. We could also go back to the Jake's hook right now. But we see the Nia. And we're just going to chase it via the map. She's really leading us away from everything. Which is a really smart move, honestly. And I don't mind taking in my 1k. Oh, she doesn't use the pallet. It's a weak pallet. She would have died anyway. But she's just running away. Dead hard. And she goes down. And we'll just take her 1k. I'm happy with that. It's been a fun game. <laughs> On the meek took and bye bye Nia. <laughs> They'll have that gate open by the time we get back. Not much we can do about it. Yeah, the fact that they're going to cleanse in a second is very me. Very clear that they've uh, got the door open. Ah, that yeah, I'm going to that. Okay. GG's. 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 It was a very good game. One last infection for the game. He is gonna stare us down. Chase after us. Pickle reversal. He's after me. Okay. Nina wanted me to molly her, but uh, unfortunately I don't have enough space in my build for the molly. You know, I'm a bit uh, overburdened. A bit late on that one. But uh, she does find hatch. Good for her. I was going for the window there to try and turn the We'll break out this door for extra points that you don't get from your friends. Get Nina in the hole. Good game, everyone. And then, of course, they see for the first time that we're only running one perk. They thought it was hilarious. <laughs> Bit of banter in the in game chat. <laughs> anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please give me a like, give me a follow, um, comment on the video, and good luck in your future games. See you later.